Welcome back, ladies and gents, and today, as you can see, Capjury is finally back in town. So we have got the Candy Sale Merge Shop to have a little look through, and don't worry, I will show you exactly where you need to go in order to get all the eggshells to merge these items. As always, I will add some timestamps in so you can just skip through to the eggshell that you need to find, or of course, as I'd much rather prefer, you can look at all the new items and of course have a look at the egg hunt later on in the video. So as far as the Merge Shop goes, it's nice gear, you can't complain. A couple member items in here which do require a special member egg shell but we will touch on that and of course there's some house items so you might as well go along and grab these adventure coin tags so you really cannot complain now before we do take a look at those eggshells I did mention earlier there is also this Grenwog shop so I'll quickly flick through these items now many of you will also know that Capjury does have the egg hunt itself now by that I mean the one that goes across law for the green blue rainbow eggs which is effectively a ginormous treasure hunt now I will ping links down in the description to the videos I've made previously on those I'm not going to remake them all over again granted they are a little bit old so if there's any cringy editing moments in there please do not go along and slate me in those comments so as you can see the Grenwog shop does have a huge variety of gear some free players some member and of course some adventure coin ones in case you want to pick them up they are all seasonal rarities so you don't need to stress about panicking because they will come back next year if you ended up missing them this time around I do quite like some of the gear in here to be fair it's not all that bad I'm not sure I'm actually going to go along and buy any of it myself but that's just my own personal preferences yours may be totally different anyway so let's have a look at these eggshells so join a green guard west is where you can get a caramel eggshell you don't just have to defeat this mob you can go along and defeat frog sards for example but that's the one i found easiest just to quickly join along and grab it from next up join a grey more the monsters here will drop you the anti neg shells this map is member only but that's okay because this is for merging the member items in the shop Next up, join a Green Guard East. I actually managed to get the drop from the Shroom Guy, but any of these three monsters here will drop you the chocolate eggshell if you want to go along and farm from. Next up, join Green Dragon, and that is where you can get the lovely rainbow eggshell, so that is very, very exciting. And then we can join Greed, which is pretty convenient, really, when you think we are getting the golden eggshells, and it's easiest to go along and defeat the Sneevels. So that is how you can get your hands on those ones there. Next up, join a green shell, and this will be for the cream eggshells just defeat the enemies in the first room because that will save you one heck of a lot of time walking through the map join Gren's story and then again first two enemies you come across chaotic eggshells will drop from here that is for one of the house items if you want to get that one and then lastly but certainly not least join the Grenwog and that is for your shadow eggshells so you might as well pick that up while you farm all the other seasonal and new boss drops that you can get from him I might cover that in a separate video but I'm not too sure at the minute anyway so a battle on egg hunt this is one of my favorite bits of the year three eggshells you just saw me get in actual battle on and then we can head into a battle on town so the first one was under Zorback, you've got the chicken cow one just there next to the barber shop. I walked in the barber shop, no particular reason, there wasn't an eggshell there. Don't miss the one on the barrel on the right and you can also grab a chicken cow one from Warlick's magic shop. Once you've finished in the magic shop, best place to go is the apothecary and you'll notice Alina is hiding an egg right next to her in here. Anyway, so once you've picked up that dragon egg, we can head back to the middle of town and into Cicero's Forge, where in his little kiln is another egg. There is one up by the Guardian Tower and one also inside of the Guild House. Once we're out of here, let's sling it round the left and you'll see the next one is right next to our ginormous golden statue and then another egg is lurking on the edge of the cliff. So to any of you who can predict the future, we are now actually going to run across to the right hand side. Where would you believe there is yet another chicken cow? Egg, which leads us onto the final one, which you can find literally above our little wolf friend outside of the old inn, right up there in the top right corner. Anyway, guys, thank you all very much for watching. Make sure you go along, enjoy this event. This is one of my favourite little seasonal ones of the year. Any major new items or updates and changes, I will, of course, let you know in a little video. But until next time, make sure you hit the subscribe button, leave the video a like, and I will see you all again incredibly soon. Until then, have a lovely day.